Here is the tricks with the mech frame from Free Flow and Die Collab. They made about 240 of these and retailed for like 1700. So, as many of you know, the DSR Plus is a very popular mid-range price um, for die, and these have just really exploded in popularity. So much so that Free Flow was like, "Hey, let's get on it. Let's uh, put in all the bells and whistles and make this thing." even better than stock so as you can see the milling job is amazing one of the coolest most creative milling jobs i've ever seen currently right up there with adrenaline but uh, they got the custom where is it free flow Okay, where was I? So, uh, yeah, didn't have the feed neck very tight. But, uh, yeah, custom barrel back with free flow on it. Free FF there above the feed neck. So, uh, they had the option of coming with the, uh, mech frame and double trigger. So, I threw this one on first and thought I would, uh, get some action with both of them. But, uh, the only complaint i would say it's very minor but this little bump here you, you you get used to it after playing with it a little while but it almost feels a little awkward but that's probably just more my personal opinion oh yeah in the hop around now i don't have this trip trigger um optimal optimally set and uh, I'm holding a camera but some guys have uh, been able to outpace their uh, Spire threes and uh, have needed to use uh, die rotors to be able to keep up with shooting the mech so some people are able to shoot these things very quickly and if I fanned the trigger I could out shoot this but uh, with just one hand this is as best as you're gonna get right now so very smooth Show off. <laughs> very smooth, very gorgeous guns. Um, in my honest opinion, though, as far as mech, I really believe you would be just as well off uh, with a fully decked out uh, Etha, uh, <laughs> Etha or Etha 3M. Um, might get some hate for that, but uh, just being honest, these definitely win in the looks and comfort category but uh i've yet to shoot any gun in mech that an etha 3m cannot match so my two cents but beauty and here is the uh blah, blah, electronic frame uh left the grip off because i absolutely despise taking off <laughs> die grips. I love how they make the gun look, but uh, just hate the process. I feel like I'm holding my breath that they're gonna rip every time uh, I try to take them off. But uh, they kind of improved them. They had a little, they, you see a little hole there and there where the front of the grip um, actually has a screw that helps hold it in place. And then the ASA comes off from those two um, spots right there so you have to um, take the grips off to swap the frames out 
or get another ASA to install. Uh, but uh, it's kind of a hassle. Um, I'm comparing the uh, neck frames uh, and um, electronic frame swap to my Adrenaline Lux. And uh, I mean, there's nothing faster than that Adrenaline wa uh, Lux uh, frame swap. That thing's just 15 seconds tops. Um, but uh, yeah, the lower light it is out here, the more the blue pops, which looks sick. But uh, here we go. So yeah, and Excel, super fun. Definitely glad I jumped on one of these.